Маргита, ты чё? Я на 500 похудела. Hello and welcome back to my channel. Before we jump into the video, make sure that you go down and subscribe to my channel. That way you are always the first to know whenever I upload a video and so that you don't miss one. С вами Евгений Медведева, и сегодня мы будем делать короткую тренировку на мышцы пресса. Hey everyone, today's ab workout is just 10 minutes, but it's gonna be intense. Your abs will love you and hate you at the same time, but it's gonna be worth it. Alright, if you wanna join in on this challenge, do not forget to leave a comment down below with your progress, or use my hashtag on Instagram, or even create a YouTube video so that we can support one another. And let's get started. All exercises today are 30 seconds each and comes in supersets. So we're doing two exercises back to back and we have a 10 seconds break. Let's get started. The first exercise, get ready for crunches. Move slowly. Use your core to raise your upper body. And remember, keep your head and neck relaxed. Squeeze those abs, guys. No rest time here guys, we are going straight into reverse crunch. With the hips off the ground using your core muscles, make sure you are engaging your core here. This exercise is really great for developing six packs. Ryan would love this. Break and the next exercise is Russian twist with straight arms variation. Let's get started. Straightening your arms put the weight further away from your body, which makes it more challenging. On your core, you can keep your knee off the ground to make it more difficult. Time here, guys, we are going straight into hip roll, or otherwise known as lower body Russian twist. Lay down, arms extended straight to the side, legs bent to 90 degrees, and twist your body left and right. Pay attention to the lower back as you don't want to injure yourself. Hold your legs with your core muscles, minds on your abs. Going to jump into leg extension straight away. Breathe in as you extend your legs and breathe out. And if sitting up is too difficult for you, you can lie down. The next exercise is my favorite workout because your abs will hurt a lot after this but it's so effective for your lower abs muscle lay down on your back and put your hands behind your head then raise your legs slightly above your head keep this position for a few seconds and lower them down and repeat lower down your legs slowly and lift them back up Make sure your back is flat on the ground when you lower your legs down as you don't want to injure your back. No 
no rest here guys. We are going straight into abs hold position. Hold your abs for as long as you can. This exercise is really effective to train your muscles. And we have the Superman with rotation. Lie face down on the floor with your arms extended behind your head and legs stretched out. Then raise your chest off the ground. Hold the tension for a second and start turning to each side. This exercise is really great for your core muscles. No rest here guys. We are going straight into Superman hold variations. Lift your head and legs off the ground so only your abs touch the ground. Arms behind your head. Hold the position for a few seconds then lower them down and repeat. Alternatively, you can curl your arms on the ground and work only on the legs to make this exercise easier. bicycle crunch. Bring your knees in as close to the opposite elbow as possible and tighten up your core dance. We are going straight into Superman hold with flutter kicks. Go back to the Superman hold position, arms extended to the front, and do flutter kicks at your legs. Guys, we are more than halfway through, you can do this. We will continue our Superman hold position after the break. You can see I'm in love with this exercise because this position not only work on your core muscles, but also improve your posture and lower your risk of back pain. On top of that, it can help reduce imbalances in your core exercises caused by focusing too intently on your six-packs muscle. side plank straight away. Start with the left and we will go to the right next. Make sure you keep your core engaged and let's smash this. You can do this. This exercise is really great for the obliques. It helps building your balance and coordination. Make sure you monitor your form. And as soon as you begin to fatigue, and it is you don't want to overstrain yourself. This is super hard, so if you need to take a little break, it is totally okay. Get ready into a plank position. Again, make sure your core is tight and your glutes are engaged and tucked in. Rest 
Next up and coming up next will be one arm, one leg plank. Planks are great because they not only work the abs, but nearly every muscle in your body. This one arm, one leg plank will definitely kick your abs into high gear and you will feel the burn. Do this exercise and you will have amazing abs and glutes and back too in no time. Make sure your core is tight and engaged and your butt is not picking up or dripping down. And we are moving straight into shoulder taps. Shoulder taps are great for your abs muscle and obliques. As an added bonus, you'll build arm and shoulder strength because you're essentially holding your body weight up with one arm at a time. I know I'm really pushing you guys here, but we are almost done with the workout, guys. Keep going. Rest up, and we are moving into our final sets of workout. Bird dog exercise. Kneel down, hands on the ground. Lift the hand and the opposite knee off the floor while balancing on the other hand and knee. Make sure you watch your form and keep your weight centered. Bird dog exercise is good for strengthening your core muscles at your abs, lower back, butt, and thighs. Then switch sides and repeat. And the last exercise we have today is stretching and cool down. It's really important to stretch your body after training. Stretching allows your body to cool down and muscle to recover from the intense workout just now. Let's finish this guys, you can do this. Enjoyed this, please smash that thumbs up button, subscribe, and turn on notifications so that you don't miss out on my new videos. And I'll see you soon. Bye.